DC Studios co-CEO James Gunn clarifies how Peacemaker Season 1 factors into Season 2 when it comes to its DC Universe canon. Following the conclusion of the DCU movie timeline in 2023, Gunn's DC Universe is closer to finally becoming a reality. With Creature Commandos premiering this fall while Gunn's Superman movie arrives in July 2025, other DC Studios projects are also being worked on at the moment. Peacemaker Season 2 is officially set to start filming this summer, leading Gunn to be asked by many fans on threads about the show's return, and also whether or not Season 1 is considered DC Universe canon. In order to shed more light on the situation, Gunn gave several updates on the series' new place in the franchise. Finally, Phil underscore Mule 21 stated, but Peacemaker killed Flag and Augie still is, at James Gunn? I mean, Peacemaker, what a joke, should always be a part of him. Especially that Harley and Flag Sr. would have both a sickfully grudge on the D-Zero, slash hebag because of Flag Jr.'s murder, to which Gunn said, many strands will remain consistent, yes, insofar as Peacemaker's story goes. Does Gunn's comments mean Peacemaker Season 2 is a reboot? Following the Peacemaker Season 1 ending in 2022, very little has been shared about Season 2's own story, but Gunn's new comments do raise some key questions. While Peacemaker Season 1 isn't considered fully canon to the DC Universe, this won't mean that Season 2 is a complete reboot. Instead, this is where the multiverse concept comes into play for the DC Universe in light of Peacemaker Season 2. While the Peacemaker cast may consist of the same actors playing their respective characters, they will likely be considered as DC Universe doppelgangers of their DCU counterparts. A lot of their backstories and history could very well still be similar to the DCU versions within the DC Universe. However, at the same time, this can also leave room for new territory to be explored in Peacemaker Season 2 that is more intact with fresh continuity.